slash SS Sniper BB. And no, you're not. Yes, I am. No, you're not. Shush. And we are on our way to the second, as you can see. And unfortunately, okay. called summer school. Yeah. And I'm new on the channel, so uh, me. This is my best friend here. You guys already know her. She's the star of the show. Yeah, I created the channel. Yes. But I'm gonna show you guys, like, tell you something crazy. Like, um, like a story, actually, because, um, more subscribers, more, yeah. <laughs> so, I'm gonna tell you something really funny that happened to me when I was little. It's a short Whee! story. <laughs> um, when I, was, when I was little, when I was little, um, well, I saw a scorpion in my room. And I called my dad and I said, Dad, there's a lobster in my room. <laughs> a lobster, it's a scorpion. And you want to hear the Timmy Tickle story, Amelia? Sure. Oh, yeah, I remember the Timmy Tickle story. The Timmy Tickles. Hey, join me in this. Okay. Wait, uh, Timmy Tickles. <laughs> <laughs> Just turn it back. So once there was a boy Sorry. named Timmy. I'm saying it. Oh. Once there was a boy named Timmy, he was always shy at school. <laughs> and outside of school, sure. <clears throat> and um, he'd always look down at everyone's shoes, but, uh, and he just liked that. I don't. Nobody knew why. He just liked that. So then he was like discovering feet. It was weird because everybody said feet boy, feet boy, feet boy. But he actually became pretty famous. And then. Um, he worked at a really fancy hospital, and he helped people, but in one room, he heard beeping noises, a lot of beeping, and then, suddenly, the whole hospital exploded. Everybody survived because they were in a different room, but Timmy, his whole body parts were spread everywhere, but... It was so weird because all his butter parts came up together to make a weird creature mutant. It's called Timmy Tickles. Yeah, Timmy Tickles. But they, they just called him Timmy. But every day, he would go around and around and around the whole oh. world and look at their feet. He would tickle them first. And then the next day, he would just eat them. And then he'll put the bodies in the abandoned hospital. <laughs> Ooh, my poor feet. And um, a little girl, he put his victims inside the abandoned hospital. He put his victims in the next. Yeah. And then uh, he heard a voice. It was a little girl. Nobody knew why she was in there. But she heard some noises. She ran right to the security room. And she looked at the door behind her. Because the security cameras were still working. And it was. And Timmy was right behind her. Dun dun dun! And Timmy ripped out her heart. <gasps> and then Timmy was a demon from now on. The first ever demon. And uh, the little girl, her name is Mia. Well, she became a demon. Timmy is more powerful than the devil himself. More powerful than Satan. But let me tell you something. He still is going around people. And guess what? He demonized me. Because last, I wish we could do a last video of me getting. Timmy, if you say his name three times, then he don't will do leave. this at home. Don't do this at home. If you say his name three times, you're me, SS Sniper Baby. You're not SS Sniper Baby. So, SS Sniper Baby, if you say you're me, then my demon will actually come out of me. But uh, Timmy goes around getting people that he wants and staying in their body. If he doesn't like them, he'll get out right away. But he's staying in me forever until I become a demon. But I don't really think that. But I really think that my demon is going to be the most powerful demon of all, which he already is.
powerful than the devil, Satan, God. Well, not powerful than God. Par- powerful than God. But no. If you say his name three times, he would come out of you and just literally make me turn into a like weird mutant thing. Okay. So don't. That's the end. Okay. Okay. This is my story. And it's, you know those things on phones when something crazy happens, like an Amber Alert? They have a bad backstory. So, <laughs> that's what you did to me. <laughs> oh, yeah. So, this girl named Amber was playing in the front yard. <laughs> Tell it. And, um, you laugh at me. and she, her mother had left to get her a snack. Her mother had came back. The bus thing. The bus had no, no, no. The bus thing. What if they see that? The, the mother had came back. No, they can't see that. The bus thing. The mother had came back, and her daughter was gone. Another day later, an Amber Alert. Her daughter's name was Amber. So she put out Amber Alert saying, "My daughter Amber is gone." <laughs> and this man, that was the news reporter, had said, "I know where the little Amber is. She's in my backyard." In the base underground bunker, dead and alive. And that little girl was my older sister. My older sister. Okay. Okay, is that the end of your story, Millie? Yeah. Okay. And actually, her soul is in. Okay, uh, okay, I'm gonna do it. No, I'm gonna do it here. So you can't really oh see my god, it. it's been six minutes. <laughs> no. And, um, no, I've been seven. Oh. <laughs> Share the blah, blah, blah. Well, there's barely anyone in this bus. Okay, guess what? This happened to me, and it is real. Really, really real. So I was at my cousin's house, right? It was her birthday, so I came over to her house, and it was, so I wanted to have a sleepover there. She said, <laughs> she said, okay. So, <laughs> So, um, yeah, that happened. <clears throat> and last night we heard under her bed, she said, oh, it's probably just the neighbors. Because she heard that a lot lately. Like scratching, chewing. I don't think it's the neighbors. And yelping. Oh! Wait, show and what? under her floorboards. Show what happens to me right now. Oh, Millie, are you dying? <laughs> I'm like the new star. Okay. <laughs> not really, not really. And, she's um. Just one of the, she's the co-star. And when we were there. Oh, wait, can I ask you please? Yeah. I want to tell my story. Which is real. Oh, Mine is real. So, well, after I tell it, then she said, oh, that's been happening all oh, those years I've been right here. I'm like, it actually sounds pretty creepy. She's like, I know. I try not to think about it. So, we try not to think about it. So, oh my god. And, um, and, that, and then we asked some guys to come over to And there was nothing in our basement. We just heard it coming from her room floorboard. Nobody else heard it, just heard. So, um, technically, the guys came over. They put a security camera in a secret room that me and my cousin did not know about. And, um, oh, what else happened? I'm forgetting. That was a long time ago. Um, then the next night, we all fell asleep, but we heard the noises again. But then when we woke up, the guy showed us the security cameras. And we were surprised. It was a guy, like, he had like holes in his back it looks like he was wearing a diaper don't laugh and um he was like bent like tibby tickles but like much more skin not good he wasn't demon i can tell when people are demon same and i me and my cousin were scared i was three she was about 10 well about 10 she was about about five she was two years older than me and um oh, your cousin's 11 now yeah and now um well who else and then the next morning 
they block, wait, in that morning, in the morning, they block the door, like with wood and 